everyone. We're back. Yeah, so this is part two of Kevin's birthday weekend. Woo! <laughs> so as mentioned, we did actually go to Houston. This was actually the hotel that we stayed in. It was called the Cambria Hotel, which was in downtown. It was in a pretty decent location. We were able to walk and get lunch from that while staying here. And here's us actually checking in. The next clip will actually show the room. Houston. Houston! Birthday Houston. weekend! Yeah, it's my birthday by the way. Hey guys, so Kevin and Lisa here and we are in Chinatown in Houston. Yeah! Yeah, so we're actually visiting Houston for someone's birthday. Wait, whose birthday? His oh no, birthday. wait, it's me! It's my birthday! Yeah. Yeah, so it's my birthday weekend, so that's why we're in Houston and we're gonna have lots of fun, eat lots of food, have fun and eat, and eat lots of food again. Yeah. So our first stop is House of Bowls. It's one of our favorite places to come to when mm -hmm. we're in town. So, so we come here go. every time. So let's do it. So here we have the brisket chow fun. We usually get this when we come here. It's actually really good, also really filling. And we also have the salt and pepper chicken wings here. Yum. So here we have the Yanto fried rice, which is basically Tashu pork and shrimp on top of fried rice and here we had the house spaghetti with bacon shrimp and an egg on top This dish is actually pretty filling and we always get this whenever we come here Next up we have Hong Kong fried chicken with a bean curd sauce. This was actually recommended by the waitress I enjoyed the chicken, but not so much the sauce. And lastly, we have Hong Kong French toast with condensed milk, I get it without peanut butter, and I have this for dessert. So after dinner, we went to a nearby plaza because what time was it? Boba, Boba time! time. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Yeah, so we actually stopped by the Tiger Sugar here in the plaza and got some drinks. Mm hmm. We got this last time we came to Houston, and it's delicious. And you see, they have a tiger to represent as well. We got the usual brown sugar milk tea. It's definitely the only thing I get when I come here. For lunch the next day, we went to a pepper lunch, and this is probably Lisa's, like, one of her favorite places to dine at. Yes, I feel like when it comes to food sometimes, I'm pretty basic and I stick to what I know. Kevin actually ordered this soup, and here's actually Kevin's order. What did you get? I got the usual beef with rice and the egg. I also got corn as well. It's actually very hot, so we don't actually recommend you eating it right away. Yeah, and that's what it looks like after mixing it around and letting it cook. I actually got a similar dish, but it comes with kimchi and cheese, and I added onions. After you've had time to let it cook, this is what it looks like. We We got cookies! Hey guys, so we are at the Houston Galleria Mall, and... It's actually pretty huge. We've been here before, but I, we like coming here just to walk around, just do some window shopping. Yeah, um, we're trying to work up our appetite for KBBQ tonight. In like three hours, so yeah. we're going to be doing lots of walking. So and we're going to actually snack on some cookies that we just got. Mm -hmm. um, so. Yeah, so thank God it's small. It's kind of huge. So we're going to walk around, try to burn off some calories. It's not going to happen, but whatever. <laughs> I'm smiling on you here. I'm smiling. Me too, me too. We are excited. <laughs> So as mentioned, we did a lot of walking around earlier to prepare ourselves for barbecue. The KBBQ restaurant we went to is called Gen, and it is actually a chain. We come here quite often, and although we had choices to go other places, we decided just to come here just for consistency purposes. So we got the usual. We got brisket. We got pork belly. We got the premium steak. We got some kalbi Hawaiian steak. Basically, you can't go wrong with that, and that's enough to fill you up, like those few selections of meat. We got so full from this. It was so delicious. And for dessert, we got hotok. It is a pancake, and it's like brown sugar on the inside, as well as sunflower seeds with powdered sugar. It's so delicious. And to celebrate my birthday even more, we went to a bar that was right next to Gan. 
and this was just a nice place to just drink, hang out, have some conversation, and cheers. So for our last and final day in Houston, we decided to get Korean food. We stopped by Jung Guam Tofu that's in Chinatown. Kevin got the Sundubu Jjigae with spicy chicken as the meat. And I actually got Kimchi Jjigae with Bugoki. It was very, very good. This place has really great prices. They're very reasonable. And you can generally get a soup and a meat for around $20. You definitely can't find that in Austin. And last but not least, we went to Snowy Village for dessert. Lisa got the taro shaved ice while I got the mango shaved ice. There was a long line at this place too, so it just goes to show how delicious this place was. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching! Bye! Bye!